Here's how to use the bookmap trading statistics and trading journal. First, you want to select the instrument that you're going to be trading. Once you have that selected, you then want to head on over to configure add-ons. Once here, you want to find trading statistics and make sure that it is checked. Once you have this turned on, every trade that you take is going to be automatically synced to your web journal. Also on this tab, you can use the stats window. So if I were to go long right now on NQ, my position would then pop up in the trading statistics. This tells me the time I entered and my average price, as well as my open PL and how many ticks I am up or down. So now once I go and close this position, it'll tell me exactly how much I made or lost, the amount of ticks, and if I were to take multiple trades throughout the day, it would tell me how many wins I had or losses, and this can be a very useful tool. Now, as you're done trading and you wanna go back and do your journaling, head back on over to the trading statistics tab, find where it says web trading journal, and click open in web. Once you register for an account and sign in, what you're going to see is all your trades are automatically imported to this journal. So looking at the journal, there's a few different things that we can look at. One, your total PL throughout all your trades, how much you've made, how much you've lost, your biggest win, your biggest loss, as well as your average win and your average loss. From there, it'll show you your profitable trades versus your losing trades, and then your profit ratio. Now, if we scroll down a little bit, here's where all the trades you take are going to be. Now, the nice thing about the bookmap journal is you can add notes to your trades. And this can be very useful to traders. Reason being, let's say that you ended up forcing a trade or you got a premature entry, you sold early, whatever it may be, you can add those to the notes inside of your journal. Now within the journal down here, it's gonna show you individually how much you've made or lost per trade. It'll also show you the amount of contracts you've taken, your entry price, your exit price, how much the trade went against you versus how much it went in your favor. And if you do trade multiple instruments, you can go ahead right up here where it says all instruments, Click there and say you're going back and you only want to focus on one instrument when you're journaling. All you have to do is check that and click apply. Now it's only going to show you the trades from that one instrument. Let's say you only wanted to focus on certain dates. What you could do is come up here. Say I only wanted to focus on trades from September 17th to September 20th. I would select that and then click apply. And then if I notice something on a trade that I wanted to add a note about, let's just go to this one, add a note. And let's just say I didn't follow my stop loss. I could import that right there and click add. And now it'll pop up right here. So if you're not using the trading journal through Bookmap, I highly suggest you do, especially because if you do have the trading statistics selected, it'll automatically sync all of your trades to the web journal. And to review all of your stats, all you have to do is go back to your web journal.